Hi, it's Sikira. So in this video, I'm going to show you how I'm flower farming in Dragon and Oaks. So most of my camp is now set up with this grid of the level three elf orange trays with a few spaces in between generally two spaces and then another tree and then just spread out all over as you can see my camp is quite filled just at the moment i'll get rid of that sapling because i don't need that i just want these trees and yeah just about all the way around almost the entirety of my butterfly is now set up like this to work on my life flowers which is one of my last two quests here i'm after that giant life flower the ancient one and since everything is pretty filled up just now i'm gonna go ahead and make a merge Alright, so let's go ahead and make that merge. I'm not going to zoom out because I'm afraid that'll probably crash my camp. We're going to bring that merge right here. It's definitely struggling to calculate all this. And it crashed again, just like I thought it would. All right, so I'm going to zoom way in here. Hopefully, I won't crash the game when I make this merge, but let's do it. Let's see what happens. Here we go. Having it zoomed way in definitely helps. If I had had that zoomed out like I had it before, it would definitely crash that game. All right, so that's the resulting mass merge of flowers all right let's see what i've got for other flowers floating around see if i can bring some in to connect up the ours off somewhere else did i have any more of the little ones no i do not i'm gonna bring these other flowers over though nearby Get rid of that sapling. They're already starting to sprout out again, which is great. That's fantastic. All right, I'm going to zoom in again, tap that gem and get it in. Now we're going to zoom way in once more and make that merge right up here. There we go. That's that second merge. We're looking to see if I've got any stragglers. Anything that's not connected. All right. We've got a five merge of purple flowers over here. And I'll take this over, make that five merge that's up here. While I'm there, I'm going to get rid of that seed. Bring these flowers over. And I had another one over there. I'll bring over. those little straggler yellow ones 
Okay. Looking good. All around these edges. Excellent. Oh, that sapling can go as well. Alright, let's go ahead and merge these. Hmm. I am going to zoom in again just to play it safe. Alright, let's merge these up. There we go, down to a bunch of the succulents. Move these around so that it's all connected. That looks good. Merge those. Get rid of that fruit tree seed. Go ahead and merge all of these. And now we're down to where I'll make sure I do five merges. Five merge those giant life flowers. Move those giant ones up, or that giant one up, and now I will delete those magic bubbles, sell them off, and get some gems from those. Move my flowers around so they're all organized. And ready to go. And now I'm just going to let this set. Ooh, I've got some red flowers that went walkabouts that didn't get pulled in with everybody else. I'm going to clean things up, let this sit idle for a while, and I will be back to do some more merging in a little bit. After some movie magic, of course, so that you don't have to wait with me. All right, so half an eternity later, I'm back and cleaning up fruit tree saplings. Looking around real quick. Going to do another big merge with those sprouts. And I've dug out my bold brave slimes that I've been accumulating over the past few years. All right, let's go ahead. Merge these on up. And hopefully I'm zoomed in enough. There we go. Let's look around the edge to make sure that there's no stragglers. Oh, there's another little tree to get rid of. Okay, everything's touching except for that one. That one can move in. Look around the edge here. We're going to tap these out real quick so that they'll start going around again to have more of those succulents on them. that and that. Bring these over. Let's see any more stragglers. Doesn't look like it. We'll get rid of that seed. All right, we'll merge these again. Merge it down here so I'm closer to my succulents.
get rid of that fruit tree sapling and that one as well that just got shown well, we have a life flower that's left over from that big merge any more left over no okay everything seems to be in order all right we'll merge these again over here so that we're having the merge center closer to those succulents again there we go looks neat and tidy shouldn't be any stragglers so we'll go ahead and mass merge those that's another leftover We'll put that over here by the those guys. I'll bring that life flower two over. All right, let's see. That's a five merge there. Five merge there. Let's be careful with these. Oh, that's six, eight, nine. That's a ten merge there. Five merge with those. Five merge the giants. Get rid of that dimensional jar, that magic bubble. One, two, three, four, five. merge those up there let's see there's one tree in the set and otherwise these are five so we'll bring one more in and make a round merge there we'll get rid of that bubble there's six seven eight nine and a ten merge there five merge those giants I have a five merge of the colorful ancients. Get rid of that dimensional jar as well. Bring these over and up. We'll just organize a little bit. We've got four of the tricolors now sat there. Get rid of the seed. Move the shiny flower up. Have a quick look around and I will pause my recording so that you're not sitting here watching me watch paint dry while I wait for these to spawn out. I'll see you again soon. Oops, we've got some flowers there. But yeah, I'll see you again soon. It'll be a second for you and hours for me. One eternity later. Now this has been a long time coming today i am going to make the life flower wonder now as i've said this has been a long and arduous journey and i'm just tapping out some of these gold brave slimes which give me the succulents this has helped immensely it was a very good investment working on that chain because those free succulents have added up a lot it's not the only way i've been going about getting my flowers but it has been a big contributing factor you don't have to go this route of course you now i've also had pretty much my entire camp spread out lately with a lot of the elf orange trees so that they will spit out sprouts for me and occasionally seeds i get rid of the seeds and the saplings since i've gotten the fruit tree wonder already although i could have worked on that some more and this is also just sitting idle while i'm doing things around the house and whatnot 
and then coming back after it fills up, merge up all these sprouts, that has pushed things along as well. And there, we're going to merge some flowers there, some here. I did buy dimensional jars when I made some of the higher level flowers, thanks to the events giving so many free golden leaves. And this is where I'm at now. Let's take a look at this chain. So, of course, we're all familiar with most of these. My favorites of the flowers are these butterfly life flowers, these blue ones here and the morning glories. I've always loved morning glories and in game, these are just beautiful as well. But there we go. We've got sunflower, sun life flower. These are really kind of cool. These lantern life flowers, they're neat. And the giant life flower ancient is very pretty, but it's time to merge those up. And I've got three of them that I'm going to keep unless it looks like we can merge these. So let's go ahead and do that five merge. And there they are. Oh, wow. The dimensional jar for this ancient colorful lily of the valley would be 300 leaves. Hmm. Tempting. So these are a two by three space. And each three merge will give a lantern life flower. Those are cool. That'll help towards getting more of these uh, wonders made. The, a colorful lily of the valley and the second wonder of Elfland. All right, what does this give me when I tap on it? Colorful lily of the va valley. Plant is said to be able to replicate itself. Neat. And there's another one and another one. Did that give me out behind there was another of those colorful lilies of the valley and another one. Let's merge some stuff away from this. I wonder if those will spawn anything. I wonder if they're like the rainbows from Merge Dragons. That. I think that just gave me a sprout. No, that was a tree that was behind there that did. Oh, it, it's given me a rain puddle off of those. Neat. So they are like the rainbows in Merge Dragons in that regard. And a gem came off. Yeah, that's very much like the um, rainbows in Merge Dragons. There's another of the colorful Lily of the Valley. Two, three, four, five. Let's five merge these colorful lilies of the valley, the little ones. Ooh, giant life flowers, ruby mystery elf nests. And tap some more off of here. Those are pretty cool. I like that. Merge those up. They're pretty on their own right. Oh, wow. So level eight flowers, level seven flowers. That's going to be quick to get back up to these from that. All right. Maybe, maybe I'll go ahead and spend some leaves and get some more of these. I'll tap that out some more. All right. So we'll merge those up. There's some more flowers. Very nice. Five merge those. That's all tapped out now. I'm very tempted to go ahead and spend, and I'm going to buy that dimensional jar there. Tap that on out. And yes, I am going to buy all of those because, wow, these are very cool. All right, so I'm going to merge those up after a little bit here. Let that go. There's a five merge there of those. There's some more flowers. Bring some more of these little colorful lilies down. 
definitely a quick way to get back to making more of this. Wow. Oh, it just spat another one at me. Very neat. All right. I'm loving it. All right. I'll see you next time. And in the meantime, happy merging. Bye for now.